Hey guys, it's your pal, Xfusion, coming to you on 97X, The Rock, K901, bye bye. This is a little radio announcer gag. A new film is uh, heading our way called Hail Caesar, and it's from the Coen brothers. Uh, I, I know very little about it. I know that it takes place in the 1920s in old Hollywood, and uh, an actor, Jackson's been away. He uh, went to jail, and uh, while he's been away, I've been feeding his cats and uh, watching his. He's got one of these media PCs with a little TV show called ER on it. There's an actor on that show that's probably the only man I would ever have sex with. It looks like that actor, George Clooney, uh, is in this film, and apparently he's uh, doing pretty well these days. Let's take a look and see what the see what the film has in store and what kind of picture it looks like it's going to be. Engage. Universal, Back to the Future, Jurassic Park, working title, Breaking Bad. I mean, Bridget Judge's diary. Bridget Judge's bye-bye. Hey, what's wrong with my face? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love sailors. Dude, this Oh, Ralph Fiennes. Army of technicians. In the Red Dragon. Oh yeah, she's so hot. God damn. Our biggest release of the year. Hail Caesar is a prestigious picture. With one I love of the old Hollywood. Bad Whitlock. I love old movies. We could see if we had but. He forgot. What a doofus. What a moron. What a maroon. Oh, Josh Brolin, baby. Mikey! Somebody slipped it under my door. We have your movie star. Oh, damn. Can you imagine if someone kidnapped George Clooney in real life? That would be it. The future. Not, I mean, that would be not cool. Hello, Bert. Oh, Channing, baby. Magic Mikey! I love him. He seems like a really good guy. Oh, God, she's so hot. Mm, God damn. Be my mermaid, baby. We don't want it in the gossip columns. God, she's a baby Oh my god. Ah, uh, Jonah. Back at it. Back at the cheesesteaks, I see. <laughs> Just kidding, buddy. I'd like to know what the hell is going on here. Twenty million readers want the truth, Eddie. Truth. Yes. Tilda Swinton, she's a great actress. You know, she's great in that adaptation. Oh yeah. Some stars. Ralph Fiennes, what a, he seems kind of like a rich asshole, if you ask me. Oh, I love her, I love her, I love Channing. He's great, he seems like a great guy, you know? I know it sounds screwy, but someone's calling from the future? Good lord. Oh, God. This movie looks like it's got it all. Oh, yeah. George A, bye-bye. Wondering what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Speechless. God, I love George. All right. Thoughts. Thoughts about Hail Caesar. It's from Universal, and they know how to do things right over there. A film came out earlier this year called Jurassic World. This looks a little bit different than that, but uh, it looks like it's going to be a quality picture. Initial thoughts on the film. Scarlett Johansson is a babe -aroni. She's a babe regardless of whether the movie's set in 2015, 2080, 3000, or 1920s, or whenever this movie come, is supposed to take place. But she's uh, she's my dream. Otherwise, this movie looks like kick-ass. It looks like kind of like a Big Lebowski-type movie set in the 1920s. Looks like there's a lot of hijinks and a lot of fun. So, hey, let me know what you think of this in the comments below. Are you ex as excited about Hail Caesar as I am? I know I'm going to be there on opening day. And I'm gonna get my butt right in the middle of the theater. And they're, they're, I'm gonna see it by myself, so it's gonna cause an odd number of seats and stuff. People are gonna be pissed. Whoa, that looks so real. Riding a bear. Poor sweet little cow. Elephants! Ooh! Christopher Walken as the orangutan. 